everybody i think we're live both on facebook and on instagram hi i'm teja priyadarshini founder for akashic center for healing those of you um, who do not know me i channel energies and i do hypnosis and i do a whole lot of other things um i also read the akashic records and uh, today is a very special channeled meditation just for you um uh, hello guys on instagram pooja hi how are you um and you're a mind i don't know what your name is but hi <laughs> um just let me know if you can hear and see me clearly before we start i always start like a minute or two early so that people can join in as well as um say hi hi tina how are you um and then we get started with the meditation so before we start the meditation i am going to tell you a little bit about today the new moon solar eclipse and uh, don't mind me darting uh, my eyes about <laughs> it's just that uh, you know i have got two screens one for facebook and instagram still not that tech savvy to understand how to stream on both uh, using the same device so please excuse me um if you can hear me all right just let me know give me a thumbs up i'm doing well pooja thank you for asking um and uh, we'll start off very soon and i'm going to just wait for like a few more people to join us i know last time we lost the feed on uh, instagram uh, when i'm meditating and i have my eyes closed i don't realize if we've lost connection so for those of you on instagram in case you're tuning in um and we do lose the feed just hop on to facebook uh, facebook same handle at akashic official you'll find my page there you'll be able to join in from facebook as well so i hope you guys can um see me on uh, facebook as well all right uh for some reason i'm not able to see the comments on facebook but i'm hoping um fingers crossed that you can hear and see me properly on uh, facebook as well all right so today is a very very special day so it is the new moon and we have the solar eclipse which is a very powerful transition phase so the last time we did this was on a full moon and it was a lunar eclipse and these eclipses are happening back to back because the energy grid of our earth is finally uh, about to take the next step so that means we are moving higher up in frequencies and this is to allow us to just do exactly that to move into higher frequencies when we did the lunar eclipse uh, meditation right uh at that point we let go of everything that was holding us back but now we're going to do something a little different we're going to now plant a seed during this time of the new moon so that going forward things are going to start transforming very 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 fast so the new moon is in gemini and Gemini is a mutable sign which means that uh, it is a transitional sign it is a sign that is in between spring and summer it's not a fixed sign like some of the other signs um so what this means is this sign uh, acts like a bridge you know from the spring to the summer and in the same way we're moving forward now from uh, whatever energies we were in the past the 3d kind of energies into the 5d energies isn't that exciting i'm sure all of you are going through some or the other transformation uh, for the last few months it's been very difficult for most of us um you know we've been feeling exhausted we've been feeling fatigued we've been feeling irritable angry upset emotional even a whole lot of things are happening hi nitin hi ash ash brook and the uh, star seed thank you for joining us um so we have to be you know very very sure of what we want and in today's meditation we're going to be concentrating on that so since new moon is all is in gemini so we are also um transforming because it's an air sign right so the transformation is going to happen rapidly it's not like a slow moving transformation after we've passed the solar eclipse phase we are going to see changes happening all of a sudden moving very very fast so if you want to manifest anything in your life now is the time to do it if you want to start a new venture you want to go on a 
adventure <laughs> if you want to uh, start a, a, a new business or work or um, a relationship even now is the time to do it now is the time to um, you know plant the seeds for it to start growing and it's going to grow very very rapidly so uh, gemini like i said since the new moon is in gemini there's a lot of positive aspects of the sun sign uh, gemini that is going to um, influence this entire shift that we're going through um and uh, what else so the solar eclipse has formed like a tunnel between the lunar eclipse and now so it's like a somewhat like a rite of passage for all of us light workers and star seeds and people who are awakening on uh, on earth at this moment to go through a portal of energy and come out on the other side with a renewed version of yourself like almost like a 2.0 version of yourself so whatever you were in the past may not be applicable anymore in your current situation you may be losing friends you may be losing people you you know you were acquainted with back then um you may find yourself in situations that do not resonate with you anymore uh, so many people have reached out and said uh, you know um, I, i don't like the job that i'm in anymore i i don't see the point in working uh, the way i was working that is someone awakening and realizing like what the hell am i doing here what am i doing a 9 to 5 job and i'm not happy doing it don't get me wrong there are people who enjoy their work who really love what uh they do and kudos to them i really really appreciate each and every one of you who loves what they do but there are many of us who are waking up and realizing um hold up this is not what i want to do in my life i want to be doing something else and so the thinking you know the thinking what else can i do what uh, what what will excite me what is it that i can do to make my life more meaningful and this is a symptom or a, or a sign that you're awakening you're awakening to your true full ability you know you're waking up and you're like i am i am something much more than what i know myself to be and that is what is so exciting and this transformation is happening much much more quicker this year than it happened last year i mean since we've gone through the whole of last year we had the age of the aquarius which was like a gateway portal we were moving from one particular age to another age and now we are bang in the middle of the age of the aquarius it's starting off it's kicking off and in the next 3 months everything is going to start accelerating and it's everything is going to change you may be very surprised at not just how your lives are changing but how the world itself is changing people are going to be you know more um they're going to start asking a lot more questions they're going to be like okay this is not what i want i want to do something else that will make me feel more harmonious with my life and more love uh, and compassion is starting to pour i mean during this entire pandemic how many of you have seen people reaching out and helping those in need i mean it's phenomenal the kind of love and compassion people have shown one another is only growing and nobody i mean nobody can can suppress that kind of energy you know so because of that we are growing rapidly we are we're taking off to another level and it's amazing the way this uh, this energy uh, is you know transmuting our lives so today's um meditation is going to be all about releasing first this, there are going to be three steps in this okay so the first step is first of all deciding what it is that you want most in life what is it is it love is it relationships is it like a good marriage a good job a career whatever it is that you want or more money more financial stability whatever you want right put that in your mind that is your intention set that intention for today's meditation and once you set that meditation what we're going to do next is find all the areas in your life that is blocking that from manifesting so it could be um something that uh, like you know probably you're not able to make more money because of this 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 like you have certain reasons why you're not able to make so much money either you don't have the skill set for it or your boss is not giving you the raise you're supposed to get or the company is not doing so well whatever the reason is half that intention okay once you set that intention that okay um i want to make more money or i want to have more love in my life or i want to have a successful marriage or uh whatever else you want i can't think of uh, reasons so when you when you set that intention right then things are going to start manifesting and in the meditation we're going to bring that up that emotion up of already 
having whatever you want and then we're going to have uh, you go through all of these obstacles that are in your way and then we're going to blast all of that out and all this information i received just before i logged in um Uh, onto this live because like you guys know my guides never give me the information of the meditations beforehand they uh, they always give me last minute or during the meditation so it's 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 phenomenal that they gave me so much information even before we started so that i can prep you guys and make you you know go through the process more easily now so who's ready to get meditating If you are then send me a heart so that I know that you are ready uh you need to find yourself a quiet place a comfortable chair a bed um <laughs> hi kavya so excited to have you um uh, just uh you know get yourself ready by getting yourself some water as well uh it's so hot where i'm at so don't mind i'm sweating so much um so a comfortable place nobody to disturb you for the next 20 minutes at least um a glass of water good pair of earphones if you're listening um hi meenu hi sai um hi seema hi trip 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 through soul <laughs> i hope i'm getting that right hi you guys i'm so glad you joined i'm seeing a lot of new people and i'm so excited to be doing this with you guys today so once you're ready like i said send me a heart so that i know that we can get going uh, on this meditation all right hi padmaja <laughs> awesome so you know the drill you can either sit down straight with your with your spine straight or you can lie down on the bed but without a pillow hi manisha <laughs> Hi Raghu nice uh, all of you guys are uh, here all of you are kicked in hi Kamal so nice uh, of all of you to be joining in today so just lie down uh, but if you're lying down on the bed then don't use a pillow under your neck because we need your spine to be straight because we're receiving a lot of energies right so when we receive energies we want the spine to be straight so ideally it's best if you can just like um sit straight like how i am sitting right now and allow your feet to be planted on the on flat on the floor and your palms in an open position so even if you're lying down just make sure you're comfortable and your palms are facing upward and not downward all right and please 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 have a glass of water ready so that once we're done with the meditation you can drink the water and what water does it's not just because you're going to feel thirsty because water has this magical properties of um pushing the energy into every part of our body so when we do a meditation like this especially a channel meditation the water absorbs like our body is made up of water right most of it at least so uh when we drink more water the water is going to channel all of that energy and push it into every nook and corner so that we absorb all of that and we get activated from the energy that is received so get yourself selves a glass of water don't skip that step All right. All right. So I'm assuming all of you are ready to meditate. Just take a deep breath in and release it through your mouth. This allows your body to relax and get into the state of meditation. It's just a deepening technique which allows your body to relax completely by taking a deep breath in and out through your mouth. I like to call them big belly breaths. Taking a deep breath in all the way in and out through your mouth. That's right. So I'm going to have my eyes closed when I channel. It helps me focus a little bit better. In case I do lose you on Instagram because it happened the last time, I'm on uh Facebook as well with the same handle Akashic Official. Just a heads up. taking a deep breath in all the way down to your belly and gently releasing it out through your mouth all the way in into your belly
and gently out through your mouth. That's right. Easy breath, not forced. Gentle breath. Gently inhaling in and out through your mouth. Now feel how your body is beginning to settle down and relax. And as you're breathing in and out, allow your eyes to gently close as the eyelids feel heavier and heavier. We're letting go and surrendering to this moment right here, right now. We're completely letting go of all the worries and tensions of the day. We're just taking a deep breath in and out. As we take these deep breaths in and out, we're also remembering that we are so much more than what we give ourselves credit for. As we breathe gently in and gently out, we realize our energies are connected with the source, the source of all things that are and the source of all things that are not. Breathing in gently in and out. As we relax into this physical form, allowing it to let go of any stress, tension or worries. As we breathe in and out, feel your entire body relaxing. And as your body relaxes, imagine a beautiful silver cord coming out of your navel, the middle of your stomach, and going all the way down into the earth. This silver cord is the cord that connects your energies into the earth. This is how we are going to ground our energies today. A beautiful silver cord going all the way down from your navel down into the ground going deeper and deeper into Earth herself. Earth has the magical ability to produce all different kinds of energies that the plants, the humans, the animals, the insects and everything else on her require. All you need to do is trust Earth's gentle heart and ground yourself with the silver cord all the way down to the crystal core of the Earth, right at the epicenter. 
Now imagine this cord wrapping around a beautiful crystal, so huge and powerful. Wrapping this cord around this crystal now. And the moment you do, you can sense that you feel more grounded, more anchored into earth herself. Now bring your awareness from the crystal core of the earth back through the ground into your body, into your navel and now extending the silver cord all the way through your body, through the crown of your head, into the heavens above. Now as this silver cord stretches out from the crown, imagine it going higher and higher above the clouds into the sky into space passing our sun and all the way to the central sun And as it reaches the central sun, allow the silver cord to wrap around the sun, the central sun. And now feeling a tug of energy with you being grounded completely from the top all the way down to the center of the earth. We are now in receiving mode. We want you dear ones to bring up the intention during this new moon solar eclipse of the thing you most desire in your life. What is it, dear one, that you most desire in your life? We are here to make sure you receive whatever you need in order to grow and to live a comfortable life. There is no wrong or right in this matter. There is no good or bad. Duality exists only on your planet. We do not recognize the power of it. Whatever your heart desires, bring it now into your awareness. We want you to now feel like you already possess all of your heart's desires. How would that make you feel? Would it make you excited to have everything you've ever dreamed of? Would it make you happy, blissful even? We want you to now focus on that energy that it's creating for you. Remember dear one, life is nothing but energy in motion. 
whatever you need to create all you need to do is focus on the energy of it like we are asking you to do now focus your energies of all of these things that you want how it makes you feel focus now and as you now focus on these very things your heart desires ask yourself what it is that is blocking you from achieving everything that you need is there somebody in your way are there circumstances that you cannot change are there any mental or energy blocks that are stopping you from receiving all you could bring all of these energy blocks or limiting beliefs or situations and people to the surface now bring it all up into your awareness we want you now to focus on all of the things that are not allowing you to become successful in life bring all that energy up now every single detail bringing all of that energy up now and as we focus on this energy of all the things that are not allowing us to step forward We want you to know how you feel about it. What are you feeling, dear one? Are you anxious? Are you scared? Are you worried? Are you angry? Are you upset? What are you feeling dear one? Let it out. We are here. We are with you. There's nothing to worry about. Bring all of that emotion out. Whatever you're feeling anger frustration sadness fear whatever it is dear one these emotions do not serve you they will not allow you to vibrate at a higher frequency so we ask you to bring it to the surface and let go of this worry let go of this fear let go of this anxiety the stress of it all it does not serve your highest one highest purpose dear one it does not The more you hang on to these emotions the more you will not be able to create and manifest the reality that you are looking at your heart desires what it wants and you have the capacity of the creator to make it happen you 
can create your own destiny. And as you bring up these layers of mistrust about yourself, the judgments that you have made about yourself, the overcritical analysis of each and everything that you have done over the years, making you believe you're not good enough, you do not deserve whatever is coming to you, or you're not worth it. You are worth everything, dear one. You're worth love, you're worth abundance, you're worth so much more. And we are here today to tell you just that, that no matter what you feel or think you are, we love you unconditionally. We love you with everything that we are and we are constantly surrounding you with our love. We are holding you in our warm embrace so that you may feel this love. Do not worry, dear child, for we are with you every step of the way. You are never alone. You are always guided by us. You are not insignificant like you think you are. You are so much more, dear ones. We wish we could explain to you in terms of human words how much you mean to us, how significant you are, and how significant your presence on earth is. As you bring all these emotions to the surface, dear one, today in front of you we place a choice. Do you want to now transmute, destroy and recreate everything that you know about yourself, about your reality? Moving forward, you will be a true, new, authentic version of yourself. A version of yourself that does not have regrets, does not judge or is critical about your own self. There is a choice you need to make, dear ones. Each and every one of you listening to this transmission right here, right now, we want you to understand this is not going to be forced upon you. You need to decide for yourselves if you want to be a better version of you. If so, we can help you with that. In this meditation, we are going to flood your systems with such brilliant light directly from the central sun, the cosmic heavens and the source itself that it is going to burn through all these layers of self-doubt, self-hatred, self-loathing and what it's going to leave behind is your pure true essence of who you really are, the bright light that you are. If this is what you choose, just affirm in your mind, yes, I want to transmute all that is into all that I can ever be. Yes, I want to transmute all there is to all that I can ever be. Destroying and uncreating everything so you may live a life filled with everything your heart desires. We sense some of you are in doubt of what this could bring. We sense that some of you are unsure what your future holds and are scared or 
fearful of the unknown. We want you to know there's nothing to fear about. There is immense light and love in your lives. Anything and everything that is going to happen from here on forward, you will be more than capable of handling it. Remember, dear ones, you cannot take on more than you can handle. You always choose whatever life throws at you because you know you can handle it. I hope this has quelled the fear and the doubt in a few of you. Now let's begin the transmutation. As you bring these layers of self-doubt and blockages and obstacles preventing you from everything your heart desires, imagine them as layers of dark spots in different parts of your body. Wherever you feel the emotion the most, for example, if you feel anger at a particular situation, ask yourself where in your body you feel it the most. Is it your heart, your chest, your shoulders, your mind, your head, your legs, your feet? And once you know where these emotions are stored, we want you now to quickly go through the other emotions that you feel and see where they are in your body. They may appear to you in your mind's eye like dark shadows. And now that you have identified them, we are going to bring in the light, not a ray, but a cosmic blast of light from the central sun, the cosmic heavens and the source itself. A cosmic blast of light coming all the way down your silver cord, going all the way down into your body, blasting through all those layers of anger, frustration, self-doubt and hatred. All those unwanted layers that are blocking you from achieving everything that you want. Burning through them now. This beautiful light melting away, burning away, making everything disappear and vanish. Nothing but beautiful light energy now goes through your entire body all the way down your silver cord into earth. Let this beam of cosmic nuclear blast go through your body, dear ones, and let it burn everything that is not wanted away from you, away from your being, away from your energy field. Bask in this cosmic light energy that is being blasted at you in tons and tons. Bask in this light, dear ones, and release whatever is not wanted in your life into this light. Let it burn it away. Let it transmute it into nothingness. Let this light keep burning within you until each and every little dark aspect of whatever that may be blocking you from progressing is burnt away. Imagine the ashes of those emotions and energy blocks and limiting beliefs dissolving into the light, turning into light itself. Releasing and surrendering now to the light. Knowing 
you are taken care of, knowing you are in good hands, knowing no harm can come to you. You are protected, you are safe and above all dear ones you are loved, you are loved unconditionally. We are so proud of each and every one of you listening to this meditation today. We want you to know we've been part of your journeys from the very beginning. We want you to know you're never alone, dear ones. We are always standing next to you. Stand tall, stand your ground, stand in love and compassion. Open your hearts to love. Sending so much of love into your own hearts. Knowing that you need to love yourself first and foremost. All love originates from your heart. And you must love that beautiful heart of yours. You must love yourself, your body, your personality. Everything that is you, that makes you you that makes you so unique. We want you to love yourself. We want you to fall in love like you would with a lover. We want you to give yourself all those perks that you give to someone you're in love with. We are enveloping you in immense cosmic love. Each and every one of you is special, is unique, and are contributing just by being here, just with your presence. You do not know how many lives you're changing or how you're affecting the lives of those around you. You are blessed and are continuously blessed and will be continuously blessed, not just by us, but by everyone looking after you, including your ancestors your angels and guides, the light beings, the source itself. You are blessed. Never forget this, dear ones. As we come to the end of our transmission, we want you to remember one thing only. You are the light. Nothing can tell you otherwise. Those of you who would like to remain in this state can do so. For those of you who would like to come out now, just take a deep breath in. Center your energies. And as I count from five to one, you may gently open your eyes. Five, bringing all our energies back into our physical bodies. Four, becoming aware of our physical bodies, able to move our fingers and toes. Three, becoming aware now of our environments of the space we are in to slowly coming back to the present day now slowly coming back to where you are one feeling beautifully refreshed feeling wonderful complete and rejuvenated Wow. Just rub your hands and drink your water so that whatever energies that have gone through us today can be circulated within the body, making us feel so in tune with the universe, moving forward 
I just need you to focus on your intention, on that desire that you have, on the feelings of that desire already coming to be, coming into your reality. Every breath you take, bringing you back now, allowing you to focus better. If you like this meditation, do let me know how you felt. And this meditation will be available to you on Facebook, Instagram, hopefully, and on the YouTube channel. So uh, do check it out. If you've missed it, you want to do this again, you can do it again. All my channel meditations can be done again as many times as you like. And I hope I'll see you guys again in another life, in another meditation, perhaps. If you want me to do more lives, do let me know in the comment section. And if you want me to do lives on specific meditations or specific topics, please let me know so that I'll be able to, you know, interact with you and do more such lives. All right. Have a wonderful evening if you're in India and a beautiful day if you're anywhere else in the world watching this. I love you guys very much and I'm so grateful to be part of your lives. Thank you so much.